Hey everybody, I'm going to be upgrading to Blender 3.4 and reinstalling the amazing Blender Toolkit, aka VPX Light Mapper. And uh, I thought I'd record it so you all can see the process. So go to blender.org, they make it pretty easy to download and install. So we'll zip through this part. Well, that was easy. So Blender 3.4 shortcut shows up here. I'm just gonna get rid of my old shortcut. Let's uh, try to run it. Cool. Um, I'm gonna click load my old settings. So it'll be seamless for me. And uh, there it is. All right, next step, I'm going to close this. And I'm going to go to the GitHub page for the v VPX Light Mapper. Um, I'll post a link in the descriptions. But so the main page is here. And you just click on the releases link over here. Currently, we're at point. Zero six. I have a GitHub account. You'll need one if you're going to download this stuff, I think. Um, but just go to the assets, download the zip file. There we go. I'm going to close that. Now, when you run Blender, you have to run it in as administrator this very first time when you want to install the VPX light mapper. Go over to edit preferences, go to add-ons, click install. You want to go to wherever you downloaded the zip file, just click on that, say install add-on. And the add-on is installed. And we want to search for Visual Pinball Light Mapper. You open this guy up, and you'll see that you need to install dependencies. So this is one reason why we needed to um, launch this in admin mode, because when you inst install the dependencies, it won't do it properly unless you're an admin. So I'm going to open this, uh, toggle the system console here because it'll show you what's going on as, as, as the um, add-ons get installed. So, sorry, the dependencies get installed. So I'm going to click on install dependencies. I think that's it. <laughs> so the next step is to close Blender and then reopen it, but not in admin mode. If you come back over here to the scene and you scroll down, you can see now we have the uh, VPX camera, sorry, the VPX importer, the VPX camera, and the VPX light mapper um, windows. And that means it's installed correctly. And it's pretty much that easy. So 
I think the next thing that I'll show is how to install the parts library, uh, but that'll be in another video and then we can move on from there. Thanks.